Night. And tonight, a solution to east traffic on the east side is causing a bit of a snag. GDOT will soon start construction on a project that will transform the interchange at I-20 and Panola Road. But the project will also force several businesses to close because GDOT needs the land they sit on. At Love and Alive's Joe Ripley live for us in DeKalb County tonight. So, Joe, I know you've been speaking with people in that area. What are they making of all the project, uh, the making of this project, rather? Well, Jonathan, a lot of people say they're fed up with the traffic out here on Panola Road near I-20 near the Lithonia Stonecrest area. Well, GDOT says it's been working on a solution to ease congestion here since 2011. Unfortunately, that comes at the cost of several of these businesses, which have called this building home for years. For me, it's the ministry. Once the doors open, it's order up. For Shelly Butch Anthony III, the CEO and founder of This Is It Barbecue, each meal is a ministry. His location on Panola Road, just off I-20, rakes in a ton of business. The restaurant first opened in 2009. That restaurant has a lot of sentimental value. In 2009, my baby girl was killed in a car accident and went to be with the Lord. That was a very difficult location to build. Anthony says it will also be a difficult location to leave. The Georgia Department of Transportation is working on a $32 million project that will revamp the interchange at I-20 and Panola Road. It aims to ease traffic and make the area safer. GDOT said it needed to buy the land. This is it and several other businesses occupy, which means these businesses will soon close. I can understand the, the expansion of the, of the pro progression of trying to move traffic in Atlanta because it's, you know, it's really bad. Yeah, I hope it gets done quickly because it's going to... It's, it's probably going to be a real mess. Janice Alexander says she's concerned about the congestion. It's already jammed up now. And it's going to be jammed up more because they're going to be working in the middle, you know, in the middle of the street. Anthony's concerned about the employees that will soon lose their jobs. He's considering moving them to one of this is its other locations once this one closes for good. And I do know that God is bigger than any dollar that I could ever make. And I know that he's going to replace it with something greater, something bigger, something better. GDOT says this is not a case of eminent domain where the government takes over, acquires land for public use. Instead, GDOT says it is going to pay market value for this land. The construction project here is slated to be completed in 2026. The last day, this is it. We'll have its doors open it's set for Saturday, November 16th. We're live in DeKalb County tonight. Joe Ripley, 11 Alive News. Joe, thanks so much.